good day. What's up, dude? What's up, bro? How you doing, sir? Good Mike. Yes, good sir. Good 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 rough, absolutely, yeah. man. Absolutely. He, Mike's been good to the RBI exactly. program since we started, fellas. Come on uh, in here, guys. Uh, they're all players that participate in the Kansas RBI program. And what is the Kansas RBI program, if you don't want to explain? Uh, basically, we're reviving baseball in the inner city of Kansas City, Kansas. Prior to our league coming along, uh, the Missouri side had an RBI program since 1992. In 2010, we started a program on the Kansas side to just try to use baseball as a vehicle to educate uh, young young men and women on and off the field. You never stop working because at the end of the day, you want to be able to look in the mirror and say you did your best, you know, you gave it your all. Worst thing is looking in the mirror and saying you wish you could have and should have. That's a bad feeling. But like I said, man, good seeing you guys, man. Wish you guys luck. Best of luck, man, with everything, with school, with ball. Keep going and never give up on your dreams because they do come true. We actually got a phone call from the Kansas City Royals and they told us that we could select five players and these were the five young men out of a thousand that had the honor of, of being able to come today. What they have to do to get this honor? Uh, just like I said, do things right. You know, uh, take, care, take care of business in the classroom. We understand that we may not be able to develop Major League Baseball players, but we for sure can develop Major League citizens and they understand how important that is and they also have a desire to play college baseball. So if they can use baseball as a tool to become educated, we're doing things right. I'll get a photo of you and Mr. Mike Sweeney. Hey Coach, nice Mike Sweeney, you. nice to meet you yes, too. We hold each other accountable though too, man. You're a big stud, this guy's probably your cleanup hitter, right Coach? Yeah, he's, uh, he's actually 14, yes, yeah, so he's, he's, he's in the heart of the order. Man, okay, so my question is, if, if you're you're the starting third baseman or catcher, you're, you got some guns, man. And Coach Ross says, you know what, today I'm going to leave big man down in the seven hole. I'm going to let some other kids play short and catch. I'm going to put big man over in right field, right? And this guy's out here pouting like this. we got a little shorty out here playing short, right? And you're looking out there and you see the big stud of your team. Is that loving you if he's out there like this? That's what yeah, we tell them. Hey, man, you love each other. You're showing how you play. You know, like we, the way we spell love, we spell R-A-C-E. We run the race. When we run the race, we get the prize. And the prize is not necessarily a trophy, but it's giving you boys memories that you're going to remember the rest of your life. And the way we, set, the way we spell love on the Saints is R, you respect each other. You respect your equipment, your coaches, your umpires. It's not your basketball that you get out, right? Well, if the umpire makes a bad call, rather than disrespecting him, you respect him. Your coach, you always respect your coach and your teammates. And then the A is attitude. And I always tell the boys, we, can, we either have a me attitude or a we attitude. So we say you're either going to be a fountain. You guys are in Kansas City, right? right. Lots of fountains, spring of life, water. Or you can be a drain. The drain sucks the water out. So I say, are you going to be a me or a we type of player? And we're looking for guys that are we type players. Thank you. Talk about that. Concentration. So if you're out there and you're mad you're not playing shortstop and you're out there hanging out like this, you're not loving your teammates, right? And the last one we talk about is E for effort. We hold each other accountable, man. Like if, if a kid throws his bat, we say, hey, man, we never yell at our kids. We say, hey, we love you. But I need you to take defense off this inning and think about your attitude or your disrespectfulness or whatever. Kids out there hanging out like this, like, I want to play shortstop. Hey, time out. Hey, Ricky, come on in. Sit on the bench, just sitting. This, this young man wants to go play. Think about: Were you really loving your brother out there? Were you concentrating? And it's really cool. It's a really cool, cool environment. So, anyways, you guys are good-looking young man. Pretty cool. You guys are here. Did everyone get a ball yet? Yes. Yeah, they're good. Yeah.